How's it going, YouTube? This is Chad. This is Paul. And we're from KP, uh, introducing you guys to a couple new YouTube hosts. I know you guys are used to seeing Ray Lopez. He's been here for a little while. Uh, he's actually moved on to, to uh, a different venture now. So I just want to wish you luck, Ray Lopez. Good luck to you, my friend. I'll miss your musk. I'll miss your scent. <laughs> uh, but moving on, we're, we're just, we want to introduce you to a few people that are over here at KP. A lot of people don't know, but we have a really big, really diverse crew. Uh, it's a lot bigger than Ray Lopez. So just want to introduce you guys to a few different people. Hopefully you guys find someone that you can identify with, someone that you can learn something from, someone that you can have a little fun with. Uh, but we're going to keep the content rolling out. We, we just want to start this out with a little bit of an introduction video. So uh, take it away, Paul. All right, so I have been working for KP for a little over a year now. Uh, I am the retail manager over at East Mesa. Uh, <clears throat> got the job opportunity. I had a friend working for KP, uh, Corey Obenauer. Hey, Corey. Hi, Corey. Uh, one day he called me up, offered me a job, and hopped on as fast as I could. How about you, Chad? I, uh, I used to order stuff from KP when I was living in Vegas, and I moved out here. Uh, once I was ordering out here, I actually got a new... I, I, I wanted to... It's kind of funny. I wanted to pick up some Mrs. T's bakery flavors. The Ooh. only way that you could do that at the time from KP was to do a local to be a local. They could only sell them in this in this exact state. Uh, so I wanted to pick up some Mrs. T's. So I signed up for the local group. Now that I'd moved out here, once I did that, it actually popped up a new option in the order screen that said local pickup. I had no idea what was going on, but it said it was pickup in East Mesa, which is right where I'm located. So I picked that. Uh, got a phone call shortly after, and they asked me to meet them at a, a local Starbucks. So went to the Starbucks. I met Chris there. I met Craig there. I met Ida there and started meeting a few different people. Um, actually, what Chris would tell you is that he saw me with a pretty much a different setup every time and uh, figured that I, I might know something about vaping. So he asked me if I wanted a job. Uh, went right back out to the Lake Security, which was a cush, cush job. Uh, let them down, let them down easily, and then and started my transition into KP. Uh, what about uh, how you got started vaping, Paul? Uh, so I got started, uh, <clears throat> my uh, grandpa passed away from emphysema, so I definitely wanted to quit smoking and knew that vaping was the best alternative for me. So I found a couple of local shops that were open at the time and just went in there and just picked up, you know, the original setup, the Ego 900 mah batteries and the Kanger T3 freaking tanks. Yep. Just... Uh, Started vaping that way. How about you? That upgrade battery, though, right? Oh, you don't yeah. want to get that 650. No, you don't no, no, want to no, slum no. it with Not, the 650. 900 was the top of the line at the time. <laughs> it was brand spanking new. The tippy tops. Oh yeah. But uh, as for me, I was I was living in Vegas, and it was a uh, it was a very smoky party like atmosphere, and I I wasn't quite feeling like I used to feel. So I I took to ECF, and I used their guidance to to pick out a good kit to start out with. Uh, I think I probably ordered from a user on there that made their own stuff. Uh, but shortly after that, Joytech rolled out with the Ego, and I remember getting my first Ego and thinking how revolutionary it was. And uh, I had that thought about eight or nine more times before I figured out that it's just going to keep going. It's like, just going to keep going every single time. So like Chat was saying earlier in the video, the content that we're going to be bringing you guys is going to be a little bit different. Uh, we are going to continue on with the reviews, with the build classes, and the Vape like 101 stuff. But there are going to be a few more videos coming your way. Uh, you're going to see us at different locations with different people. You're going to see some people from corporate. You're going to see some people from the retail shops like the sales associates from Tempe and East Mesa. Um, you're also going to be seeing some special guests, like he was saying. Uh, Nephos Dave might be popping in. Maybe a Craig. Maybe a Craig. You Who never knows? know. Who knows? Uh, well, hopefully also, also some juice makers and just some other people to bring some better content for you guys. So if you guys get the chance, go ahead and hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, drop a comment down below. Let us know what you thought of this video. Let us know what you want from future videos, uh, criticism, constructive criticism, whatever you guys want. We're, we're here to help you guys out. I know I need to lose weight. <laughs> <laughs> so that one can halt. <laughs> Not going to happen before the next video. Maybe the one after. Keep watching. <laughs> <laughs> So for now, this is good night, guys. Uh, again, this is Chad from KP. Paul. See you guys later. Thanks for watching.